Welcome back to Western York Living. I've heard an old adage a time or two that states a goal without a plan is just a wish. Well, I believe that correlates to a lot of things we do in life. And for those with an unfortunate diagnosis of cancer, a plan to treat cancer is very important. As I found out during a recent visit to Winsong Radiology, their PET CT scanner and fabulous doctors are helping plan out treatment strategies for local patients. When you mention the word cancer, many emotions and thoughts come to mind. Uneasiness, fear, anxiety, unknowns, those are just a few. At Winsong Radiology, I also believe hope should be one of the thoughts associated with that word as well. It all centers around the personalized care they offer and the state-of-the-art imaging they provide. They were the first in the area to provide PET-CT scanning for patients and their newest PET-CT scanner is allowing them to provide better treatments for all patients. A PET scan combines the anatomic imaging of a CAT scan. People have had a CT scan of the you know, chest, abdomen, pelvis, and it looks at the anatomy. A PET scan looks at the physiology, so what the cells are doing behind the scenes. The number one use that we have is in oncology, trying to find out if something's tumor or not tumor, um, or finding is the, is the cancer progressing, or where's the area to biopsy it, or if it's something that needs to be biopsied at all. There are other uses that are less common, um, such as looking for inflammation or if people have abnormal tumor markers. Um, they might not have a history of cancer, but they may have elevated markers. So we do this to see if we can find cancer elsewhere in the body. Um, it's a tremendous examination because it gives you the power of CT and the power of the physiologic imaging, the, the, the PET scan. And so we're able to find cancers that are much, much, much smaller than you would otherwise see. And I'll give it a good example for prostate imaging. Um, when we've seen uh, lymph nodes, a lymph node in the pelvis could be 10 millimeters in size and still be normal, so you know, 10 millimeters. But we'll find nodes that are 3, 4, 5 millimeters, and with the new PET agents for, for prostate cancer, we'll find cancer in those nodes, and that dramatically changes the course of action for the patient. Um, besides the fact that we have, you know, the, the physicians all have over 20 years of experience with PET, that's really one of the important parts of the whole, of the whole process is having folks who know how to you know, look at the images, understand all the artifacts, all the problems that can go along with the imaging. Uh, and really work their way through the, the, the whole challenge of, of multi-modality imaging. It is important to note that patients must meet certain guidelines to have a PET-CT scan, but the images are extremely helpful in planning out treatment options for all types of cancers, including breast, lung, and prostate cancers. Since it is a whole body scanner, it's also ideal for imaging melanoma and lymphoma tumors. For Dr. Fodi and the rest of the doctors and staff at Winsong, the first step is planning out treatment options by better knowing the past history of the patient. We're involved in several tumor boards for lung and breast and other, other things um, where we talk with the referring doctors and, and discuss the findings to come up with a plan because there are a lot of cases where there's crossover between inflammation and tumor and you need to come up with the best plan for that patient. Some patients you're more aggressive in, some patients you're less depending on their other medical factors. So when you discuss it all together, it makes it a much better outcome for the patient. This is an excellent test for patients with known cancer to assess whether the cancer is spread whether it's spreading or whether it's improving with therapy. We use this to monitor therapy, and then we'll also use this um, even a year or two, three years out after they've had therapy. They, we believe that they're cured, but then they want to make sure that there's not any residual cancer. We get a PET scan, and if it's negative, that's a very, very good sign that the cancer is cured. The PET-CT scanner at Winsong offers the largest bore of any scanner being used today and can accommodate patients of any size. But I'm certain many patients would also say the technicians at Winsong or what make the experience more relaxing. I think it's important that the patient knows what's going to happen for the entire test from the time they walk in our door until the time they leave and um, we take a lot of time and care with each patient to make sure that they feel comfortable here and first of all we have a premier scanner here it's the best in Western New York. Um, it actually offers the patient a continuous movement while they're being scanned um, and I think it helps the patient's anxiety level when they, when they see that they're just going to be moving slowly through and they can kind of anticipate when they're finished. Uh, we can get the most claustrophobic patients through this exam and when the patients leave here we try to reassure them that yes they're here for, um, and, it, and it's stressful but they're, they're on a path now and at least um, if they do have a cancer they're all over it. They're doing what they need to and now they can move forward to the next level of care that's needed. At Winsong Radiology, they offer complete care for each patient and individual treatment plans for their unique diagnosis. 
To find out more about all the services they offer, including PETCT imaging, head to their website at winsongwny.com. You can also give them a call at 631 2500 to speak to their helpful staff. Their main offices are located at 55 Spindrift Drive in Williamsville.